seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, zero. Mission. And we have lift off. plus 40 seconds into liftoff. Falcon 9 has successfully lifted off from Pad 40 at Cape Canaveral Air Force Station, carrying our Starlink payload out into space. Now we just throttled down the engines in preparation for max Q, which stands for maximum aerodynamic pressure. This is the largest structural load that the vehicle will see throughout ascent. Should be coming up on max Q in a few seconds here. Max Q. And there's that call out that we just passed through Max Q. In about a minute, we will have three events that happen very quickly one after another. That will be MECO, or main engine cutoff, stage separation, and SES-1, or second engine start one. And main engine cutoff is where all nine of those M1D engines shut down, to slow the vehicle down in preparation for stage separation, which is when the first stage separates from the second stage. After stage separation is SES-1 or second engine start one. And this is where the MVAC engine lights up for its first burn and propels the second stage along with the Starlink satellites to orbit. And at T plus two minutes, we are about 30 seconds away from those three events. Again, that's MECO stage separation and SES-1. Again, it's SES-1 because we do have two burns of the Merlin vacuum engine on today's mission. We have a beautiful view of the first stage. Stage separation confirmed. And there you just watched Miko, main engine cutoff, stage separation, and that second stage engine ignite. We're just about 15 seconds here from fairing deploy, and on your right-hand screen, you can see a view of inside of those fairing halves, looking at the Starlink payload as well. And on your left-hand screen is first stage, making its way back to Earth. Fairing separation confirmed. And there, as you watch on your screen, that is confirmation that those fairing halves have deployed.